Hey friends, KJ4YZI with Ham Radio Concepts. My 7100 here. Maybe you have one as well. There's a feature in there that comes in very useful in contesting, calling CQ, looking to make contacts when you just don't want to call CQ over and over and over again. Maybe on field day, you don't want to do it 10,000 times that weekend. Well, there's a feature built in, the voice keyer, which allows you to program a couple different messages in here, whether you're calling CQ, whether you're contesting. It's a contest weekend this last weekend in March, and a lot of people are utilizing this function in their radios to save their voice. I'm going to show you how to do it. Now, we'll start in the beginning here. Okay, so on the 7100, you can see you have menus, different menus. This is menu 3, M3, so I want to go to menu 2. And you'll see on the bottom there's a voice button. Clicking the voice button will take you into voice transmit menu. There are four slots on here for four different messages at a minute and 30 seconds on each slot. Plenty of time to record your message. Uh, if you push menu again, it takes you to the second level, which has uh, functions that you can set and record and stuff. Pushing send will take you back to the send menu where you can choose to push different ones. So let's say you want to program number one slot for CQ, CQ, this is KJ4YZI on a typical day. And then you want to set number two for contest weekend and number three maybe for a special event. Let's do that. So we'll, we'll click on menu and we'll go here to record. Okay. Now you can see there's four slots. I have 16 seconds in the first slot and the rest of them are empty. So I was playing around with it. So we're going to do this. We're going to click on number one, and we're going to go into the menu, and I'm going to record a message. As I'm talking, you can see I'm not pushing PTT. It's just it hears what my voice is doing when I'm talking into the microphone. Okay, You're not transmitting at this moment. You're just previewing your audio waveform here. And the little bar at the end under the 16 here, that's where you're clipping. So you don't want it to look like this because you're going to sound like crap. That's going to be very overmodulated and just distorted. So you want to talk in a nice tone to where it looks like this, it's not clipping, and it can hear your voice clearly. A good recording means a lot of people will hear a good signal and you'll get good contacts. If you're a natural loud person, there's some people that are just naturally loud, you can go to mic gain and turn this down. I have mine set to 23%. Uh, the 7100 does have a hot audio, so you don't need to run that mic gain way up. Being overly loud is not going to make you more contacts in a pileup. If I get out there and say, Kilo, Juliet, four, they're not going to say, oh, that's, that's the guy right there. Sometimes people are turned away from that. So make sure you have a good, clean audio. Now I'm going to record, and I'm just going to say a message and record it. And you'll see when I hit record, it should tell me I have a minute and 30 seconds of record time. Hello CQ, hello CQ, CQ 20 meters, calling CQ, CQ on 20. This is Kilo Juliet 4, Yankee Zulu India. KJ4, YZI in Florida, calling CQ, CQ. This is Kilo Juliet 4, Yankee Zulu India. KJ4, YZI, listening. And you stop it. Now, to preview that and play it back, I'll turn this up and we'll hit play. Hello CQ, hello CQ, CQ 20 meters. Calling CQ, CQ on 20. This is you can hear it's a little bit four, windy. I'm, I'm clipping just KJ a little four, bit YZI in Florida. with my T's calling and CQ, my C's. CQ. This is Kilo Juliet 4, Yankee Zulu India. KJ4, YZI, listening. Now I would turn my mic game down and redo that again, but instead I'll go to number two here and we'll record a number two and I'll turn the mic game down to 9% uh, sounds good. And we're going to do it again. This one I'll do for a contest weekend. CQ contest, CQ contest, Kilo Juliet 4, Yankee, Zulu, India, CQ contest. All right, and if I was listening or on a, an active contest, racking up contacts, I would play this. CQ contest, CQ contest, Kilo Juliet 4, Yankee, Zulu, India, CQ contest. Okay, so you have your voice transmits programmed in. We'll go back, and now you'll set your stuff like your interval. So we'll turn this back down. You have your repeat time. I can set this to 5 seconds, uh, 15 seconds, and that way you don't have to push the button every time. It just plays every second, sec 7 seconds until you key up and stop it. And the auto monitor for playing it back out your speaker, you turn it off if you don't want to hear yourself. So now that I have that set up, all I would have to do is go back to send here and push number one. I don't have the antenna on this radio today, but you could push number one and it's going to play that over the air. Make sure that the band is not in use on that frequency. 
and have fun with it. And this will keep you rolling. Let's say you want to get a drink of water and you don't want to stop. But what I usually do is once I get a pileup going or I have a few stations calling, I turn that off and I go right to my mic and I talk into it and you know, QRZ, CQ, CQ, and get more people. Once it goes stale and I run out of people listening, I'll go back to setting the voice transmit up and uh, broadcasting my transmit message. I don't use it often. Maybe you've never known it was on there. That's the little video here on the feature of the voice transmitter on the 7100. There's a video also I did of the same voice transmit here on the 7300. You can check that out as well. 73 guys, KJ4YZI.